The whole thing seemed far looser once we like let go of this concept of needing to breastfeed. For a while, I didn't realize there were other options. Hey, if it's not working, don't force it. Go get some formula. Formula is a great food for babies, first and foremost. It's not going to damage their bodies. It's not going to damage their guts. Breast milk is important, but formula is equally important for some babies in order to grow and be healthy. Formula is milk that's basically synthetic that is provided as a supplement for babies' uh, nutrition in the first year of life. The primary type of formula is cow's milk based. Um, it's the main source that's used for babies in that first 12 months, but some babies cannot tolerate cow's milk and need other types of formula, such as hypoallergenic formula, should they be allergic or intolerant to cow's milk formulas. Some babies who do not necessarily need hypoallergenic formula can benefit from a soy-based formula, so for families that prefer to go more of a plant-based route, some babies can do combination with both breast milk and formula. After kids are several weeks old, they can transition to the powdered formula that's over the counter. The powdered form is easy for parents to mix and make at home and provide to their baby in bottles. Some parents are very concerned in those first couple of days when the baby, for multiple medical reasons, may have had to use formula. And I'm here to assure you that you did not ruin your baby's health and formula is food. And for some babies at the start of their life, formula is medicine. So it can be absolutely necessary and it's absolutely healthy and a great option for growing babies.